Hello everyone. So today we are going to implement this uh, electric field or electric portal material effect. So this is what you are going to get at the end of this tutorial. Uh, you can use the same material on any shape like a globe as well. If you want to have something like a electric globe or some magical sphere. So yeah. Let's see how to implement this today. Okay, so this is what I have in the beginning. And this is just some mesh of a portal door. And this is just a sphere. So the mesh is not important because we are only going to focus on how to create the material. Right, so now the only thing you need is some noise texture like this one you can use an inbuilt noise texture as well so, so you can just search electric noise texture so you can use one of them you like and then let's start creating the material and electric field. now i'm going to assign this material to this door at the moment it's nothing so let me open it and I'll change the blend mode to translucent because this has to have some kind of a transparency look like transparency to look like an electric field and then let me just drag and drop this electric noise material uh, texture of material now if I connect this to the base color and opacity also if I connect oh nothing appears since this is a blue texture let's try blue channel yeah so now this is what we get so here let me add a multiplier so that we can have some emissive property and connect it to the emissive color as well and if i have a multiplier like 100 this is what you are going to get so now as you can see here this thickness increases so instead of using a multiplier let's try a power node for both see now it right okay so if you want to have a change in color let's set the vector parameter color and let's multiply uh, let me have white here so let's multiply this color with this output and put into MCO color and base color right so instead of 100 I put 10 it looks like this okay and uh, now we do have some sort of a electric shape but we need to have a moment so for that if you right click and type chaos we get this normal from height map chaos so and if you hover over it you see we get this expensive hmm, not so if i double click and open it so this is here we can see a preview so we can see some kind of a moment a four-way moment is here uh, but inside that we have something interesting so this motion four-way chaos node so let me copy this texture object and this chaos node and paste here we don't need it. 
I just used it to get this node. So now for this texture, I'll use my electric texture and as for the coordinate i'll get texture coordinate so so text code and speed can you promote these two parameters okay scale parameter speed uh, definitely it should not be zero so yeah device uh, is also scalar parameter device let's put one also here and now I'll get this output and plug it here see now we get some effect. Uh, uh, opacity also. So you see some black static there color. So opacity also should go from this. Uh, maybe not from that. Let's multiply with this result and connect. Oh, this is fully transparent. That's why. Right. right. Now we have something. Okay. Uh, let me increase this. All right. So as you can see, it's thick. Um, we can try something like this. Before we put this value into here, let me subtract. Um, if I yeah now you see we it looks more thin not electric effect is not everywhere so if I increase this the electric effect reduces only in some areas if I decrease this 0.5 it increases so Keep it at one. Right. So this already looks good enough. Now let me apply this. So if I increase the speed, now you see it increases the effect speed. But this device I do. Okay, I think it's, I'm not really sure, maybe it's like a tiling effect, let me slow it down, okay, I'll increase it, oh, Oh, I'll keep it at one. You can research what it does. Oh, how, oh, here we have a description. How much to reduce overall combined results of the four way ad? Okay. Alright. Uh, now let me apply. And here we have our result the electric effect. And for this also, let me apply this same effect. So we get some kind of some electric sparks around the gate as well. Uh, how about this sphere? Right. So in this sphere, let me uh, since this is not a two-sided material, it looks somewhat less 3d because we don't see the other side so let me create a material instance and 
enable two-sided for that and use that here yeah. now it looks better all right so this is what we want to do do for today so thanks for watching as always project files will be available for the download in the patreon page link would be in the description below and if you like to support my work you can get the membership of the patreon club see you in another episode goodbye